So the bar method uses your own body weight, the ballet bar, and a few props to create a transformative workout. And today we are getting a crash course on it. Sarah Oates, owner of the bar method Highland Park, joins us now to break it down, as well as Samantha, who she is our a demonstrator here yes. today. So thank you both for coming in. What is the bar method? Are we doing ballet here? Are we doing Pilates? Are we doing combination? What is it? You got it. We are doing a combination. So bar method is a sculpting and a toning and a lengthening exercise. Exercise. Mm. So we will sculpt your entire body, head to toe. We generally start with your shoulders, move into the triceps, biceps, and then kind of work bottom up. So calves, thighs, glutes. All in and one finish workout? With, yeah, all oh, in one workout. Wow. That's what we really are a one stop shop, right? So you're going to build, you're also going to lengthen your muscles. So that's really the beauty of the bar method. Okay, so this is where I get confused because we're always talking about lifting weights and building muscle, but you're lengthening them out. How does that we happen? Are. So what happens is we use high reps. Okay. It's a high intense interval, but it's zero impact. So that's what keeps our longevity Choice. within the workout. Yep. Yeah. But after that, we lengthen your muscle. So each and every exercise you will build, you will kind of break down the muscle. You actually might start even shaking mm -hmm. and then we follow it immediately with lengthening and a stretch. Okay. Okay. So let's show some moves here that we can talk about um, that would explain exactly what yes. you just said there. Sure. So Sam, if you want to go ahead and come into maybe fold over, let's say. Oh, so okay. this is a exercise that's for her glute. So she oh. might work in small little isometric lifts and lowering, okay. lift and lowering. Now we might do this for a couple of minutes, right? Oh, One to three minutes. You Ooh. can see that the muscles contracting. It's like a deadlift. Exactly, okay. very similar. Yeah. Right, so you're gonna feel that nice little isometric squeeze and then a very small release by about five to 10%. Ooh. And then we'll follow this up with stretching. So then she'll release, she'll come into a pull away stretch, what we call, which is almost like an upside down L, Ooh. where then she's going to release her glutes, she's gonna release her low back. Okay. Ooh. So again, we kind of break down the muscle there mm -hmm. and then immediately follow it with stretch. So you see that and, and just you think, okay, that's such a tiny movement. How are you getting any gains from it? So many gains. Okay. So many gains. So like I said, it's through that high repetition mm -hmm. where you truly hit this fatigue, okay. right? That's where the muscle begins to break down. Okay. okay. Break down the muscle fibers. Then they become vulnerable to change. And that's where we see the change. And then you get your length. All right, so, okay, like a dancer. You end yeah. up with a dancer body with exactly. a bar for like the ballet bar. So that's probably why you use much lighter weights. You don't use the big bulky 15, 20, 30, 40, 50 pound weights. We do, yeah, we generally use light weights. And you'd be amazed. We'll, you know, hopefully get a chance to yeah. do a couple exercises with you. But you'll start with the two pound weights. Okay. And then after about a minute or so of this constant repetition, mm -hmm. it feels like 20 pounds. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, show us. What, what should we do? Okay. Well, go ahead and grab. Fatigue us. Yeah. Go ahead and take a uh, pair of weights. Okay. Mm -hmm. Perfect. And these are two pounders? Yep. Those are two pound weights. Okay. Yeah. So we'll take you through a couple of exercises. Okay. Mm -hmm. We'll do a little bit of a front and kind of a little bit of a back, right? Okay. So go ahead and bend your arms in half right here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now make sure your wrists are facing each other and then lift up to shoulder width, shoulder height. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay. Perfect. You guys are naturals. Now just hold them right here oh, for a moment mm -hmm. and then push your weights up. Up one inch and down one inch. Up an inch and down one inch. Oh man. So we're working into your anterior deltoid right here, the front of your shoulders. Mm. You're gonna get a beautiful sculpt. We'll do about four more, and then we're gonna take an active reset. So okay. we're gonna stay engaged in your muscle, and this is where the burn factor comes in. I'm starting to feel it already. Yeah, do one more. Now in two counts, you're gonna lower down. Now I say two counts, because we usually do this with the music. Oh, got it. Okay. And we work with the beat of the music so that you're not using momentum, but that you're able to use pure power. And so of your muscle movement, yeah. but still front of the shoulders. Exactly. Okay. And these are taught in classes, not individual, right? Yep, group class. Now hold at the top and do another little presses up and Girl, inch and then down it. Now you're feeling it, right? Yes. So imagine doing this for a couple more minutes with some different choreographic changes, just some for some variety and fun. Okay. I'm, I'm yes. out. Okay. I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. Now release so you can roll out your shoulders. Okay. okay. Now, so those are for your shoulders. Again, you will get the best shoulders of your life by mm -hmm. doing these exercises. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's work your triceps a little bit. Okay. So lower your weights by your side. Mm -hmm. Now soften your knees and then hinge forward a little bit at your hips, okay? Mm -hmm. Sweep both arms up higher than your hip. 
and now lift your arms just like you did. Up an inch and like, down an inch. Ooh, like a little pull. Up an inch to and down an inch. But yeah, to the beat of the music. Okay. We really want to avoid momentum. Got it. So this is what makes the sets so effective and efficient. Are doing all the work. They're doing a hundred percent all the time. Now how long are your classes? 45 or 60 minute classes. Ooh, 45 yeah. minutes, you can do a whole body exercise. Like you can do a whole body exercise. Now, the next one, hold at the top, and we're gonna do little tricep extensions here. Little bends and stretches. Now you should feel that nice little squeeze right on the back of your arm, right on the back of your mm -hmm. arm, but we're also getting your posterior deltoid, the back of your shoulder as well. I love that. I, mm -hmm. may, I may change you over. Oh, I may, I may win you guys over. Oh. Yeah. Well, this is great, Sarah, thank oh, you. Wow. I, I feel so awesome. approachable and doable and not intimidating. No, it's, absolutely. It's not, it's either one or the other. People think bar looks too easy or it looks too hard. Right, but well I can very... tell you it is very effective. Yes. <laughs> there you yes. go. Yes. Bar Method Highland Park is where you can find Sarah and get more information. Here's the address and social media handles, so give them a ch check them out.